Hello, people and bots. Grandpa Canuck here. And we are in Stationaires for another tutorial. And today's tutorial is going to be about runways and atmospheric traders. So let's just get the game loaded here. Now, here we are in my little trade area. And let's see what we can do. There we go. We found Meteor Munchies at 9. So we can register that. Now notice the 15 marker with the airplane. That states you must have a runway 15 long and your landing pad must be at least 7 by 7. I have such out there. And let's just see. We can get everything set. Oh, landing pad's unpowered. That might help. Okay, so he's going to fly along the runway. See him in the distance. He'll fly over top. Come down the runway. I can't see it very well out there. We'll see him getting on the final approach. Here he comes. There he is. And he... would come in and land. Okay, let's go out and greet him. Now, Grandpa, remember to close your helmet when you go outside. Something you gotta do. Now, all of my trade stuff is all on one uh, circuit. And that includes the waypoint at the end of the runway. I'll talk about that in a minute. So here's the 7x7 seven seven atmospheric lander. See, he's got jet engines. Okay, and he's got the cargo space in the back. And he's a robot like everybody else. And you trade with him just like everybody else. Ooh, let's get a chocolate bar. We'll buy a chocolate bar. There we go. <laughs> Okay, thanks, buddy. Now, watch how he flies. We'll go to the end of the runway here. So he goes down the runway, turns around, and then takes off up the runway. I've had a couple of people mention that they have this going on. Okay? So, it is best if you line the center of the runway up with the center of your landing pad. It's not a must. You can direct things into the edge of your landing pad or with these turns and taxiways, etc. Now this is just a rally point and you can go on from one to another to another and you can make a big complex way of getting it in. Now, it wanted a runway of at least 15. So that's what we have here. We have a runway of 15 or 16. So you can see this is made with all the same stuff. And landing pad taxi holder. Let's just take this off and we'll show you. So it's all made from uh, the standard unit here. And you can make many different things. Taxi corner, threshold, taxi hold, and the waypoint. Okay. So we're just going to do the uh, taxi hold here. And it takes a piece of steel that you have to have. 
Okay. And you'll know it's working when you have the light at the end at the waypoint and the flashing lights leading in to the landing area. A runway must be three wide. Okay? It can take corners and turns and whatever else, but it must have at least the minimum length of what the atmospheric trader wants. In this case, it was 15. I think it's actually 16 long here. The other thing is the landing pad threshold. is only one. You cannot have three. Okay. And it looks like my waypoint has disappeared. Okay, that's odd. Let's uh, let's just take this up. And he must have burnt it off because I had it too close. Guess you need at least an extra tile. So the waypoint, trader waypoint here needs to be powered. Okay. And you need to take your screwdriver and you have the ability to set a few things up. The height for clearance. The next waypoint, and in my case it is simply um, the waypoint that I have at the end. Okay, and then I can turn the uh, visualizer on or off. Those are your options. And that's all you need. This has to be powered on the same circuit. So this power line comes all, whoop, all the way back. It's on the same circuit as everything else. And there you have it. At least 15 long. You can use as many taxi holds as you want. In the end, it should line up coming into the center of your landing pad. And that's it. This is all you need to land the atmospheric traders. Okay, must be three wide. come together to the uh, taxi holding point, just as the visual on the sides that I've done here. And you can only have one threshold, not three, only one. And I'm beginning to wonder if this would work better at the other end. Maybe the threshold needs to be at this end and the taxi point can be at the other end. So I'll try that out at some point in time. So that's it. This is Grandpa Canuck signing off. Hoping all you people and bots are having a good one and are good to each other. Take care. Stay safe. Be good.